What is up guys, Aerodis Cause here once again with another video and today we are uh, we are here week 13 against the Commanders, a uh, huge, this game is huge for us and the, and the playoffs, um, what's up everybody, um, you know, let's talk, we got a couple things we gotta talk about, let's look at the playoff picture for, for first thing we gotta talk about, the playoff picture. Currently, the Commanders lost to the Falcons last week, so um, we are currently now the leaders of the division at 8-3. and three. Commanders will be taking their bye next week. Um, so this game, I, I went over the scenario, if we wanted to win the division, the next three games, we either have to go 3-3 three and three in the next three games, which means we're going to have to basically beat the Commanders twice, beat the Eagles once. Okay? The worst we can do and still take the division lead is going to be 2-3. and three. We lose the game to the Commanders. We, beat the, we have to beat the Eagles, and we have to beat the Commanders in the second game. It's either we win the first game, we lose in the second, or we lose in the first, win in the second game against the Commanders. Okay? And we can take a one-game division lead with the Vikings, and uh, we got three games, like Minnesota... Minnesota is one of them. Uh, I'm trying to figure out who are the other. In, uh, Minnesota, Indy, and um, and Philadelphia would be left on our schedule. Okay, so we, I, I think preferably we need a three, win these next three games crucially, uh, to make sure we get ourselves in. The next scenario, if we end up winning only one of the next three games, is going to have to be a, a game with Minnesota. Okay, we would need Minnesota. Luckily, this week, Minnesota lost to the Jets. And thank you, Rise, for absolutely beating, <laughs> for beating the Vikings. I needed that. I needed that hugely. Okay? So, Rise beats Minnesota. That puts them 8-4. We're currently 8-3. If we win this week, we get one game ahead of the Vikings. Um, Vikings are currently a 7 seed. We have two scenarios. Either we win the division. Right now, if playoffs started now, we would face Carolina. Uh, or we, we drop. And our worst scenario, we would either be out or we would make the 7 seed. And we would have to probably play Arizona. So, that is like... That's kind of the balance that we're going to have to face here in these next couple weeks is playoff scenario. So, I can't wait. I want to see how we do today. I, this is a must win. If anybody knows, I, I have to win at least two of these three. Two of these next three. Because commanders have a one game. They, they're, they're bye weeks next week. We could trap them eight and, eight and five. Or nine. No, eight and five. And we could win the next two games. That puts us up 10 and 3. And then if we drop a game next week, we would still be 10 and 4 to our 9 and 5. So, I mean, we have a shot to take the division lead. And then we would have to win out after our second game against the Commanders to, uh, to take home the division. That, that's what, that what it boils down to. Okay, that's what it all boils down to, is these two of the two of the next three games. All of these next three games boils down to the division. If we do not win two of the next three games, then we're fighting for a wild card with Minnesota. That that's currently, that's currently the scenario. So, I mean, it's up in the air. I mean, right now, it, it's close. Is gonna be. It's definitely. I'm gonna have to go full sweat. I might have to go full sweat. I might have to go full sweat. I mean, <laughs> everyone. Giants versus Commanders. Commanders. Two two eight win teams facing off right here. We need we need some huge oil. we need huge we need some huge W's right here. Next next news, we have a breakout. We have a breakout apparently. DB breakout. Let's see who it is. Let's see who it is. Oh, Xavier McKinney. 
To upgrade to an X Factor needs uh, needs to hold the Commanders less than 100 yards. That ain't happening. <laughs> or get Xavier McKinney three interceptions, force fumble, tackle for loss, or sack. Okay. So basically, Xavier McKinney needs to absolutely ball the fuck out of his mind. Okay. Got it. To get to an X Factor. Okay. Well, we're good. Okay. Well, I'm going to tell I'm ready. I I am ready. I'm ready. You can tell me when the search went ever. And we're gonna have to play a high pressure game, possibly with the division at stake against the commanders. This is a high stakes game right here. This is high stakes, high stakes. This is for basically the division right here. Okay, I got four notifications. Oh god, all of them from last night. <laughs> god damn, hunger. <Okay. laughs> so send it. Okay, send it. Here we go. Loading in. This is this is this is a big game right here. Okay, let's do this. Come on. We need to pick up the W. We just need to pick up the W here. That's all we need. That's all we need to do. All we need to do. Um let's see if we can get it. Let's see if we can get the win. We need to get the win. We got to play literally the best football we can. It's literally what we need to do. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. So far this season, we got to we got to get going, bro. We got to we got to get the win here. We got to get the win. We got to get the win against the Commanders. Okay. Gotta check. I don't know why my depth charts haven't been saving the last couple games. I'm gonna have to figure out how the fuck to do that shit. My depth charts have not been saving the last couple games. I don't know why. I always redo my depth chart and then I literally go in and it's like, oh, it's not saving or some shit. I gotta figure out why the fuck my depth charts are saving. Yeah, I need Xavier McKinney to ball out. <laughs> Xavier McKinney. Needs the ball out. The game should have sent you an invite. Game should have sent you an invite. You an invite. Okay, I, I sent a message saying the game should send him an invite. Okay, let's do this. And for the commanders, Bucks and Cavs play tonight. Okay. Huh? I haven't gotten an invite yet. Oh shit. Okay. Let, let me uh back out. Okay. okay. Um shit, I gotta see what his uh Xbox gamer tag is. Um I gotta see what his gamer tag is. 
Discord, see if he's got his Xbox. No. Okay, what's your um okay, what's your what's your what's your uh what's your uh gamer tag? So I can send one to you. And what's your gamer tag so I can send one to you? Okay. King of the streets. King of the streets. Dear me. Bro, shout out to Dallas, my bitch is a star. Oh. Brand new William. Oh. Back in these hunters, uh, like you are, so. Love with that show. Love with that show. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <sighs> fucking. Uh, uh, okay, I can send him an invite if I can just fucking find someone. Send me your gamer tag so I can send one to you. Wait, what, bro? What the? Oh my god! Oh god, you're fucking kidding me. Just search? I searched! There we go, okay, there we go. Advanced settings, okay, we're all good. Unis. Oh, let's go with the classic blues. Let's go with the classic blues for this game. Okay, solid return. Okay. Throwing Jones. Demarking on the check down. All right, good start. Good start. Okay, never mind. He's going to ignore, ignore, ignore me. Oh, shit, I. Okay, let's do this. Okay, I had Bellinger wide the fuck open, but we still got three yards out of uh, out of that. You know, Siga white side. And then put in Galladay. See if we can hit him. What 
what's his uh what's his defense looking like el toro inside stuff okay so he's basically going to be able to defend the inside run damn and nobody blocked number three shit all right not good not good start we got one first down now we got fucking Ah, ah. Got, had no time. No time. I had him open. I just didn't have enough time to get the ball to him. Okay. Lucky bounce? No? Okay. <laughs> I thought I thought I was going to land like a little bit before the fucking... Um, Malik McDowell, Leonard Williams, Denary Ho, Aaron Robinson, Julian Love. Okay, we're fine. Edmund and Collins. Okay, Brian Robinson broke that shit. Okay. Okay, defense, I'm going to need you to have a good start here since def uh, offense did a poor job. Okay, I, that was, I didn't see Sam, I thought Samuel was doing a regular out route. I didn't think anything of it. Shit, okay. Got Sam Howell in. So it's got Gibson in. The play fake, and now here's Howell to throw it. Taking a shot for Samuel. And he overshot him there. It's out of bounds, incomplete. Love the idea, love the concept, but you gotta leave a little room on the side. Yeah, McKinney didn't move at all, so I mean I don't know. Let's see what we can do here. Second and ten. See what we can bring. Why is, why did no one, like, good tackle immediately, Robinson. Aaron Robinson with a good tackle. There we go, there we go. Come on, third and seven, I need a big, big, big play. Big play, big stop right here in fourth, fourth. Malik McDowell! Oh my God! That was big. That was huge. That was huge. Oh my god, that was huge. Okay, that was like a bullshit scenario, but that was huge. Uh, I slid. There we go. Eight yards. Thank you. Thank you, Daniel Jones, for fucking... Knowing how to slide. Saquon for the first. There we go. Saquon for the first. First and goal. Come on. This time, I feel like he's going to definitely bunch up right here. There we go. Jonathan Allen. Inside stuff. Let's go with outside run. Let's go with outside run. Oh, we won it, but we're... Oh, my God. Give me goal line. Give me goal line. Again. Give me PA power zero. Though. Give me the air. Just call it special. Oh. 
Oh, throw it away. He had everything covered. Shit. Just give me, just give me, just give me my three. Let me just take my three and we can move on. Just take my three and move on. There we go. Three. Three nothing. We take the lead early. Off the Malik McDowell interception that I had no expectation for. <laughs> I did not expect Malik McDowell to intercept the pass. I'm going to be absolutely honest. <laughs> I didn't think a defensive tackle was going to intercept. Shit. But apparently I was wrong. Okay. Hope and pray time. <laughs> Hope and pray time. <laughs> That's what I like to use. Hope and pray. Good tackle. Good tackle. Three yard run. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with three yard runs. I'm fine with three yard runs. I'm fine with three yard runs. I'm fine with those. I'm fine with those. Tackle. Three yard gain, okay. That makes it, okay, third third and four. We're gonna need a stop right here. We're gonna need a big stop. Oh, good. Oh, Holmes, Holmes swatted it. Okay, is he gonna take three or is he gonna? He's going for it? Oh shit, we're gonna need to stop. We need to stop right here. This is big. This is big because this gives us field position. If we can get a stop, please, let's get a stop right here. Let's get a stop. We got it! Defense holds! Defense holds! The defense held up, baby! Defense held up! Oh, only if you can hang on to it. Damn, I needed him to hang on to that. If he hung on to it, bro, I mean, we're talking, we're talking big. Big yards right there. We're talking big yards. Okay, I'll go ahead. To throw on second and ten. Jones. Bellinger. Oh, Bellinger. Bellinger. Oh, let's go. First down. First down and more. First down and more, baby. Bellinger. Broke a tackle. From Westry. Oh, Westry, I think tried to. Play. I think he tried punching it out. It just, you know, did not work. My zig. Let's go right down the seam. Elijah Moore. Oh, he misses one to the one yard line. To the one yard line, baby. End of, end of the first. End of the first three zip. We got a shot. We got a shot. We need to we need to get some. We need to get some right here. Right here we need something. Formation. Formation goal line. Goal line. Yeah, let's, let's let's try a QB. Let's try a QB. Try a QB sneak. And we got it! Touchdown! Daniel Jones getting in there. His 19th touchdown now of the season. And they are able to add on to their advantage. And let's go. That would make it a 10-0 ball game. 10-0 ball game, baby. Like I said, high stakes, high pressure. High stakes, high pressure. We gotta perform. We gotta perform. Gonna kneel it. And it will come out to the 25 as he will not attempt to return. Out 
there set and ready for this next drive. The Washington offense. Okay, big drive right here. Oh shit, I oh I overcommitted. That's on me. That one's on me. I overcommitted. I overcommitted. That one's on me. That one's a hundred percent on me. He's gonna run some hurry up. He's trying to fix some plays right here. Yeah. Cover that crosser. Oh, Fabian! Got him. Step up and play on that, dude. Dude, you gotta. Gotta step up on that. I mean, that's, that one is inexcusable. Incomplete. Let's go. He was not in bounds. Luckily, he wasn't in bounds. A good tackle. I I hate how Terry McLaurin just outran everyone. Oh come on, dude. Okay, no one plays the fucking line of scrimmage at all. I mean, everyone just fucking sat there and watched. I mean. Good tackle. He's running hurry up. I mean, I don't know what to do. I mean, he runs hurry up. I can't change shit. I mean. Oh, fuck. I knew he was going to John Dotson. I knew he was. But McLaurin got open. Oh, God. Help me. God help me, please help me. I am, I'm already starting to get fucking worried and pissed, dude. I don't know what the fuck. Just gonna kick it to one side. We're gonna take a fucking touch back. Let's see five wide out right here. We're gonna need big plays. We're gonna need big plays. Good. Good. Good shit. I need outside runs, dude. Yeah, halfback stretch. I need outside runs today. I mean, it's the only way Sa Saquon's gonna be. Able to strive, I feel like it's going to be some outside outside running game because he's got that inside stuff and he is playing the inside. So our running game is going to have to be strongly on like inside or outside run plays. That's how it's going to have to work today. Okay, I don't like Shepard, and this is my kind of problem. I have to get it out. I mean, literally, I don't know why. Um, I don't know why nobody even blocked fucking uh, Chase Young. He's literally sitting there, X factored and everything, and he just literally went by untouched. Okay, big play right here. Got him. Receiver white side. Arthea, my bad. Not Arcega, Arthea. My bad. My bad. My bad. Who is even in on this play? Who's even in? Well, Slayton then. Okay. See, so yeah, maybe, um. Let's go, Sterling Shepard. Okay. Nickel and dime him. Nickel and dime him. 
continue the nickel and dime. Solid run, solid run. I mean, solid run. Oh, he called a called a timeout. I don't. I, I'm kind of clueless on that one. Um, oh yeah, Shepard's still in. I, I keep forgetting. Okay, is this man to man or zone? I'm gonna leave Barkley in the block. Oh, you're lucky. I actually hit A. That was going to be a pick. That actually kind of saved me. That actually, like, kind of saved me. Let's see if I can get Galladay right here. Galladay or Whiteside. I mean, that's that's what I want. No! There is no way that man jumping like that. Man jumped like he's a fucking Olympic fucking jumper. God, Saquon's like 10 yards further down the field. I mean, I don't get how the fuck some of these people jump like this. And like, they jump like super. Well, we gotta sell for three. I wanted six, but we fucking had to sell for three because god dang, everyone here is Olympic fucking jumpers. They'll, they'll jump everything apparently they'll even jump the empire empire state building apparently in this game good tackle this drive we're gonna need we're going to need uh we're gonna need a fucking turnover or something i need a turnover i need a turnover or a stop stop or turnover whichever one i mean we're gonna need one Oh my god! It's... Fucking Curtis Samuel just outruns the whole defense. <laughs> Literally just outran the whole defense. Look at this, Dory Jackson. Dory Jackson, slow as shit. Slow as shit. Slow as molasses, Dory Jackson out here. Slow as molasses. Literally gets outran by the whole fu by fucking Curtis Samuel. Like, come on. Come on. Get your... Oh, Dory, get your fucking shit together, dude. Get your fucking shit together. Kick team out there for the commanders as they send this one away. 216, we gotta make drives down the field. Let's see if we can get a drive or something or whatever. Tried to cut back and you know, no, uh, you know, I didn't get anybody really in the second level right there, so we couldn't really get any good cutbacks. So tight end in, and, okay, oh, two minute warning. We gotta go down and score up uh, some some type of points. It's gonna have to be some type of points here on this drive because there's you know if we if we get a fucking I, I can't go down going into halftime. I have to have some type of points, either three or fucking seven. I mean, Back to throw. Jones. Oh, oh, Darius Slayton, thank God. Thank God, Darius Slayton. Thank God for Darius Slayton on my team. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for Darius Slayton being on my team. He's been running a little man to man. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. He's got Bellinger. Dude, Bellinger. And that's good for a pickup of 10 yards. And they'll be left with a second and about a foot. They'll give him to Barkley out of the gun. Oh, Saquon. Saquon, huge run. Huge run by Saquon. I'm in field goal range. I mean. We could try. He's gonna call time. Oh, he calls timeout for me. Okay, okay. I mean, hey, I wasn't gonna use the timeout. I'm in field goal range. I was gonna try and see if I can, you know, score a touchdown. But well, 
But hey, I, I didn't want the timeout, but you know, thank you. Thank you for the timeout. So let's use the timeout here. Okay, drive, drive back flood. Throw that shit away. Thank you. you over here though, Saquon. Bellinger on a zig. I want Elijah Moore. That's what I want right here. On second and ten. Jones. How the fuck, bro? Man doesn't get a hand on him. Man literally taps him with his shoulder. And you're telling me that he's dropping that shit. Fuck off. Absolutely fuck off, game. If you just want to say, hey, we're not going to let him catch the ball, don't let him catch the ball. Let him fucking drop it. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. The Bellinger held on. Thank you, God. Oh, oh, he called a timeout. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Call a timeout. We needed a timeout, actually. We needed a timeout. We needed a timeout, actually. Check and release. I mean, yeah. Well, back to throw again. Forced out to his left. Yeah, just out of way. Smart decision here. This close to the end zone, and it brings up second down. Nothing on first down, so the ball remains at the eight-yard line. Second and goal. Give me a zig. Let's hope and pray. Throwing Jones. Let's go. Let's go. We got to go for two if we want to make it a 21 point ball game. Oh, West. Oh, fuck. Okay. Well, we didn't get the two, but it's 1914. We're gonna. He gets bought half, so we gotta make sure no fucking nothing, nothing gets past the defense. If I have Curtis Samuel outrun my entire defense one more time, I am absolutely gonna lose. It. So somebody on this drive better have their shit together and get a stop, or there will be fucking consequences like major he's probably going to try and run a play similar I feel like he would I mean he just realized hey the deep ball everybody got ran past I mean I feel like yeah that's what he's doing that's why he just fucking motioned out what did I say? What did I say? What did I literally just speak out of my fucking mouth? As the first half is winding down, slide for the PAT. Oh, he's going to go deep because he just realized his receivers can outrun all my corners. So, you know what he's going to do? He's just going to go nothing but the deep ball. What did I literally just speak into existence? God, I swear this team is useless half the time. It's really useless. It's like totally useless. It's a pa like human paperweights. The Giants' offense at the line, ready to begin their next drive. 
And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. Jones in trouble here, and down he goes. And this offense going to elect to burn a timeout with five seconds remaining in quarter number two. And they line up now for what will likely be the last play of the first half. A final shot before break. Jones. He's going to look deep for more. And a double coverage, and it's intercepted. Picked up by Obi Bellafonwu, and he will be brought down. Good job, Daniel Jones. Good job getting it to him. Yay. I, I swear, every Hail Mary just doesn't go my way. It goes always as an interception. 40, 40 yards inside run. 96. We're going to have to focus on the medium, I guess. A uh, fucking deep pass. The, that's where all of his yards are literally from. It's just deep passes. I mean, literally, that's where all of his yards have been from. That's where literally all of his yards have happened today. It's literally over the top. Come on. Come on, defense. Well, I need you. I need you the most. Come on now. Yeah. Duh. Oh yeah. The most godlike blocking everyone gets. I mean, holy shit. <laughs> I mean, God. Aaron, like fucking Antonio Gibson's out here looking like Barry Sanders. Let's go, Thibodeau! Let's go. We covered everything deep. Luckily, we covered everything deep. I mean, I, I, I know what's happening. This is... Yeah, not, not in bounds. Third and 19. Come on, defense, please. Please, third and 19, do not fucking fail me. Do not fail me on a third and 19. That's all I'm asking here. Oh my God! Third and 19, y'all can't do shit. Human paperweights. Literally human paperweights. God! I know. Oh my God! I have human paperweights on my whole team. It's terrible. Dory Jackson, what do you have? Like 94, 93 speed? Curtis Samuel's literally making you his bitch. Fucking do something, man. Just fucking do something. Just fucking do something. The opposition laid down the challenge and opening drive touchdown here to start the second half. And Charles, now you feel like this group needs to get Yeah, I didn't really get any blocking on the outside. No blocking on the outside. I mean, I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. I got absolutely no blocking. I mean, I got nothing. God. This is literally going to be, I think, maybe the whole rest of the whole game is literally going to be hoping and praying. <laughs> I got no time. He literally sent like everybody in the mo everybody and their mother after me. I mean, I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. I mean, I got no time. Throwing on second and long. Jones. 
Fucking scramble. Just scramble. Just scramble. Third and nine. I'm gonna need I'm gonna need a first. I'm gonna need a first down right here. Move over just in case he wants to blitz a linebacker or fucking corner. Let's put uh, let's put Shepard on a slant too. Why the fuck not? Pick a side. Pick a side. Ah, uh, yeah. Of course, I don't have time. Of course, I don't have time. Of course, I don't have time. Of course, he rushes three fucking people. I think I have no time. I have no time. God. I can't wait for fucking Curtis Samuel to go deep and just absolutely burn everyone. And fucking, I'm going to be sitting here like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Like, come on. I am about to, ready to be so tired. Dexter Lawrence. Thank you for showing up. My replacement may get an opportunity. Your head better be on a swivel. Totally. Or maybe I just need to get out of the game for a while because I just can't slow these guys down. They've got to figure out a way to disrupt these offenses. And typically... And of course, Tremaine Edmonds is just sitting there like he doesn't know what the fuck to do. Great. Okay. Thank you for showing up today. You're absolutely useless. I mean, look, he just he sits there. He doesn't. He didn't even drop back in coverage. He just literally sat there the whole time. And I didn't even really even... Oh, Thibodeau got to him. Hey. Good job on the sack, even though you're probably going to be fucking deep. Ah, oh, yeah. Fabian Maru, 94 speed, 93 speed. is just so slow, he just can't get there to play the fucking football. Does, this, does the game just like seeing me fucking get screwed? Does it like it? It, 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 does it have like a fetish or something like I swear to God it does because I just like how for like the last whole fucking couple weeks my team has played the most perfectly solid defense I fucking play this game right here yep oh yeah look oh wow he was so wide the fuck open what do you know I can't play man to man because if I just play man to man I'm getting burnt because I got no one that can cover speed wise apparently apparently 93 speed is no longer fucking good apparently it's atrocious fucking 93 speed gets outran by everything apparently when I face the commanders oh McKinney that was much needed that was like much needed that was much needed we gotta score this drive. We gotta. We gotta, dude. I hate how they slow down. They have literally four, five, six yards of space and they slow down to go catch the football. Like, bro, you don't need to slow down. Dude, you keep running and speeding up, bro, you're fine. Oh my god. It, it's like, it's like, it, it's, it's, it, it makes me scratch my head. It makes me scratch my head why the fuck they slow the fuck down. I don't need them to slow the fuck down. I need them to speed the fuck up. I think this is a man, a man scenario, I think, right here. Yeah, he's, he's, he's going with, um, he's, he's using Westry. So this is a man to man. This is a man to man scenario. Looking to throw again on second down. Jones. A quick pass Good tackle. And get him down good tackle. Well, actually, I shouldn't say good tackle. Good, good catch. Good first. Down. Yeah, they just play. I mean, 
his defenders actually kind of play up. So I'm playing back. Let's go. Thank God for Daniel Jones. Thank God for Daniel. Oh my God! Pick it up! Oh my God! Of course! Of course! Oh my God! Uh, of fucking course! Daniel Jones fumbled! Because the game makes me want to suffer! Yeah, Thibodeau's not ta Thibodeau did not tackle him. He did not do anything. He literally watched him. Literally just Oh my god. Dude. Oh my god. Help my fucking sanity. Yeah, double team tackle. He breaks both of them. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. You know what? Fuck it. Yep, no one's underneath because, you know, we all are sitting 10 yards fucking deep. Because, goddamn, no one fucking even cares at this point. Nobody wants to play defense. Nobody wants to do anything. Offense can't get their fucking shit together because they're dumb as shit. I mean. Go fucking run to the tip ball! What is Maru doing? He's literally... Oh my god. He's literally looking at the ball being tipped in the air. And literally sits there and does nothing about it. The ball's literally tipped up in the air. He's sitting there doing nothing. Incomplete. Thank you, God. Because if McLaurin caught that shit, I was going to be pissed. One of the toughest things about playing defensive back is pattern reading. Trying to figure out what they're doing. And on that one, they had to fly. Just sending a guy downfield with the in route accompanying it. What people call a dagger route. Trying to hit the guy underneath after the clear out. In this case, though, they're not able to get it done. Yeah, they said forget the underneath route. They went for the guy on the fly, but as you said, incomplete. Yeah, fucking Terry McLaurin outruns the whole fucking defense, dude. Is everyone slow? Is everyone just this slow on the team? 91, 90 fucking three. Every speed imaginable. Are you guys just this slow? And he scores. God. What the fuck is this defense? Literally does nothing. Nothing. Literally does nothing. Just sits on their fucking asses and does nothing. They let everyone outrun them. Literally everyone and it's outran. And yeah, no one's even close to Antonio Gibson. Guess what? It's a two point ball. He gets two points. Because screw me even more. Now now we're now we need three like what three touchdowns? Two touchdowns and a field goal in three fucking minutes. Game's over. Dude. Game's over. Because defense is literally human paperweights on the whole field. But in this case, the offense figured it out. Human fucking paperweights, man. Human fucking paperweights. I've never Never, literally, defense gets outran by fucking everyone. Now, now, Commanders is gonna be what eight and fucking four. We're gonna be what, or nine and four, and now we're gonna be eight and four. Throwing to start the drive, Jones. What? And Daniel Jones can't fucking throw a pass on the run. Everyone else can throw passes on the run. Dead fucking accuracy and everything, but fucking Daniel Jones, nah. Nah, he can't. 
Oh, it's good. And yeah, he doesn't even throw it accurately. Good accuracy, not even close. And then he wants to be cocky and do laterals. Okay. Everyone just gets outran, apparently. We don't know what the fuck. I mean. I can't, I can't even throw it. I don't have any time. I literally have no time. I drop back, I'm already getting fucking piped down by the fucking defensive line. No fucking time. Yeah, look. I'm literally, <laughs> I literally have no time. I literally have no time. Literally no time. Literally no time. I literally just dropped back, didn't even have a second to read the fucking field, and I fucking already got five people writing the fucking sack. Look at this. One, two. I mean, why are you calling timeout? The game's over. The game's literally over. What do you want? Literally, why the fuck are you calling a timeout for? God, what, does your stats matter that much? God damn, his pussy's gonna bleed if he doesn't get his stats. Oh my god. Desperation time now. Here's Jones. I mean, hey. Do stats matter that much? You really are about to really want to go down and score another touchdown because your stats matter to you that much. Just kneel the football. Game's over. Kneel the football. Game's over. The game's legitimately over. Okay, thank you for the interception. Yeah, I'm I'm just gonna fucking kneel it. I'm 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 just gonna run it and just wind the clock down because I mean apparently he just wants to stat pat. I ain't gonna fucking let him. He's already won by two scores. Cause my defense is absolute useless garbage. It's, you know, I, I guess. Frustrating for a defense because they've got them pinned down deep, and on the first play, they gave up a run that keeps an offense on schedule. Yeah, because three to four yards, that's all you're looking for right there, right? That's absolutely perfect, really, as a play call. You get three to four yards on first down, that's what they talk about to us all the time, about being ahead of the chains or on target, ahead of schedule. They were after that run. Second down, here's Barkley again. And he tried to bounce it outside, but they'll stop him behind the line. Ain't calling another fucking play, the game's over. <laughs> well, we, we held for a half, and then literally the defense just went to shit. The whole entire defense just went to shit. Literally, the whole defense just went to shit. second quarter do you think they thought at all that that would be their last points of the game no I don't but what a second half the adjustment whatever they did in the locker I can't wait to look at these player worked. stats Sam Howell 449 yards th five touchdowns three interceptions man literally just aired it out deep and even when I tried to play deep man literally just like my whole defense just kept getting burnt like, no one tried, and every time I would get down the field, offense literally went to shit, and Daniel Jones just acts like a stupid idiot. I mean, 
Shit, we gotta win. We have to win the second game. Like, literally, the whole game for him was nothing but Jahan Dotson just going deep. That was all. Or, uh, or fucking McLaurin going deep. I mean, literally, whenever I tried to play the deep ball, they still get outran. I mean, it's so fucking bullshit. I mean, bro. Fucking Bellinger at 89 yards. Elijah Moore at a touchdown. I mean, we couldn't get anything today. I mean, we, we couldn't get anything. I mean, we got sacks when we needed Like, Dexter Lawrence got one, but Thibodeau got one. But it didn't matter because no matter what, third and 29, third and fucking 24, second and 15, I mean, he fucking just throws it deep and he gets it every fucking time. I mean, you know, we got the lucky shit with McDowell and, I mean... I don't know what to do the next game. I mean, literally, I played deep. The strategy was to play deep, and still, no one played deep. Everyone got burnt. Everyone still got burnt. I mean, I don't know what to do next game. Everyone still got fucking burnt. Like, what? I don't know what the fuck to do. I, I seriously don't know. I seriously don't. Man to man, zone coverage don't matter. Fucking, you know, I'm just getting burnt. I'm just getting burnt every play, every play, every play. Every, I'm just getting burnt every play. And we're not gonna get McKinney because McKinney didn't. You know, McKinney really didn't do shit. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, we got. Okay, yeah, sure. McKinney got an X factor. Yeah. Okay, I guess McKinney got an X factor. I guess I, I don't know how. We lost. Technically, Commanders would take the division lead. <sighs> now we're the same record as Minnesota. We have to beat the Commanders in the second game. We're, we just have to. I mean, literally, we, we, it, we have to. I mean, it's... If we don't, we're fucked. I mean, and we would have to have Minnesota fuck up for the next couple weeks. So... Oh well, thank you guys for watching. If you're on YouTube, like, comment, subscribe. If you're on Twitch, drop a follow. I'm Mary Just Cause. We'll see you next time. Fucking bullshit.